Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing another try on bikini haul because you guys seem to be loving them. You want to see more and you guys asked to see a part two of my cup she version. So I'm super excited to be sharing five more swimsuits with you guys today. Thank you cup she for sponsoring today's video. As always, my opinion is honest and my own. I will leave links to everything in the description bar below. Let's get started. Okay, I'm gonna start off with this navy one because it was definitely my favorite of the haul, which honestly surprised me when I was just looking at them. I was expecting this to be my least favorite, but I absolutely love the cut of the bottoms. They are like a V cut in the front and they sit higher up on your hips, which is so incredibly flattering. They will really elongate your legs and it's very slimming on your waist to have a um, bottom that goes a little bit higher up. So I love these. Cupshe swimsuits do tend to be on the more family friendly side. If you are going on vacation with your family, your boyfriend's family, something like that where you want to be a little more covered up, you're looking for something a little bit more fitted, structured, sturdier than like your typical Shein, Zaffle, that kind of swimsuit, I would really recommend checking out Cupshe. They are great for that kind of stuff. This material is super thick. It's a ribbed bottom that is like triple lined. And I love these. This was probably the cheekiest bottom from them, but they still were not bad at all. And then the top has got like a little asymmetrical fit to it. It's like it's your bandeau one shoulder style, but it's got a little tortoise ring right there there and then two straps along the back for a little like one shoulder ish strappy back action I don't really know how else to describe it this does have that silver clasp that I mentioned in a lot of different videos is not my favorite however this one is a little bit taller than the ones from Shein and it's definitely sturdier which I really like it doesn't really feel like it's gonna fall off just because it isn't so chintzy I guess and the strap on this is adjustable as well so I just love this it was really great quality and I thought it looked adorable on next up I I grabbed this teal swimsuit and I really liked this as well the color of this was super flattering on my skin tone I have a pretty deep tan already even though it's like literally the beginning of June but I thought this was really flattering on this is like a classic bikini bottom from Cupshe. this is very standard for them they have a much thicker band along the side than some of the other swimsuits I share from other brands and like I said they are more of that full coverage fit their bottoms are also not raw cut which is another reason why I really like them they hold you in and there's not as much sand that gets in your bottoms um, I just think that they have a more secure fit to them and as you can see they have that band this is like the equivalent to wearing um, hipster underwear to bed that's like how I describe it which I know sounds kind of silly but the top to this is super cute as well um, really really flattering when it's got that little cutout in your like cleavage under boobish area um, I don't really like the way it looks when I just hold it up but then every time I put that style on I'm like gosh that's so flattering so I really like this it's got thin straps which is my favorite and there's no clasps or anything which I really like I prefer when my swimsuits don't have clasps or any self ties just because I feel a little more secure in them I feel like they're not going anywhere and they have a little bit more support the straps are adjustable on this though this was the next bathing suit I grabbed and this was probably the skimpiest as far as material along the sides it still has a rather full coverage bottom so you can still wear this around family it is white but these are not see-through at all and it's got like a little peach stitching which I think is super super cute I like the thinner sides and then the top is a triangle style um, I typically don't reach for triangle styles because I feel like they don't have much support to them and I have a little bit of side boob which is not my favorite however if I do grab a triangle style cup she is the retailer that I grab one from because I think they do them really well they have wider cups than a lot of other retailers so they do hold you in without any spillage on the sides again a really thin strap and the back looks like this I know this isn't everyone's favorite back and it does have a very thin small clasp However, I still really liked this. I grabbed this in an extra small. I grabbed this black suit and I'm wearing a small in this. Not all their swimsuits were available in the extra small, so I'm wearing a small in some of them. I will leave sizes linked below as well. But this is what the bottoms look like. Again, these are very thick along the sides. They are definitely full coverage. So if you are just transitioning into bikinis and you like something a little more full coverage, this is a great option. This stitching is also super popular. It was really popular last season, so I have a feeling it will be back this one 
as well. I love this style top. It is more of like that sports bra style fit in the front. It doesn't have a razor back or anything. It's just your classic back with a, this one is actually like not your typical clasp. It's one that goes like this. I prefer a hook like this rather than the like silver metal clasp I showed you earlier. Just personal preference. These are adjustable straps and these are really, really thick. This bikini top surprisingly has a lot of support to it. So if you are a little bit larger in the chest, I would really recommend checking out this specific style. And then last but not least, I grabbed this cute little white swimsuit. This was probably my least favorite of the bunch. Nothing wrong with it. I just liked the other ones better, you know, um, but this is white. This one was not see-through again. I know a lot of people worry about that, but cup she swimsuits tend to be pretty thick, um, so they don't have that issue. These are a little bit thinner along the sides than some of the other bottoms I've shared, and they've got just a little dainty ruffle right there. They also have that little cinching along your butt that's super flattering. If you have a very tiny butt like myself, you will probably like having this. Again, a full coverage fit to them, and I love the top to this one. I think that tops that have this like little self-tie along the back are so cute. I know I just said that self-tying isn't always my favorite, but I think when they lace up like this and then you can tie it in a knot and then a bow, it's pretty secure. It's a pretty supportive top in the end, so I really, really like this one. It's got elastic straps to it, which are very comfortable, I feel like, and they've got just a little bit of ruffle to them. You can remove the pads in this as well as all the other ones. I don't think I mentioned that. They do have removable pads, and I just love the white. I don't know. I think white makes you look so tan in the summer times which is obviously perfect all right guys that is going to be all for today's quick little haul i know this one was short and sweet but i hope you guys enjoyed if you want to see a part three to my cup she bikini series be sure to give this video a like and let me know in the comments below if you want to get 10 percent off your purchase you can use my code yt mckens2 i will leave it on the screen and in the description bar below i do believe it is 10 percent off 70 dollars or more so you have to purchase a little bit more to get it but cup she swimsuits while they are a little bit pricier than some of the other retailers I have recently been sharing they are so worth it they are like I said a little bit higher quality they are definitely well made and a great family friendly option so hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you in my next one bye guys